Up to 60% of buildings affected by unsafe cladding are yet to be identified. Subscribe and hit the bell for more notifications on our latest videos. Seven years on from the Grenfell Tower fire, up to 60% of buildings affected by unsafe cladding are still yet to be identified. The report from the National Audit Office also says that, of the buildings identified, work has completed on only 12-16%. to 16%. It reads, there also remains considerable uncertainty about the number of buildings needing remediation, the cost of remediating them, and how long it will take to fix them and to recoup spending in the long run. So far, 4,771 buildings have been brought into the portfolio for remediation, but it is taking longer than expected to identify the remainder, and some may never be identified. With a potential of 7,200 buildings or more still to be identified, many people still do not know when their buildings will be made safe, contributing to residents suffering and financial and emotional distress. The report recommends that the government publishes a target date for the completion of dangerous cladding and remediation works. They also say that there should be greater transparency on remediation performance. To discover more of the report's recommendations, read the full article in our Safety and Health category. Read more at twinfm.com.